Hi and welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to extract this list here from these three tables. So I have the master table and I also have new data from list A and list B. So I just wanted to get those that are new data, those that are to be added on the master. So this is the list here, the example. So uh, we're going to eliminate those that are in the master list already. So we're going to do that in the Power Query. And this is also an example of uh, when to use the list that difference. So let's do that in my workbook here. So first load these three tables. So uh, I'm gonna load the master table first. Go to data tab and then from table range. If your table has headers, check that my table has headers. So I have my headers here and then okay and then rename it just rename it as master table and then make a connection go to the home tab close and load to only create connection okay that's it let's do that in the to list uh, first list a go to data tab from table range check my table has headers okay and then rename it as list underscore a and then make a connection close and load to only create connection okay and the last list list b data tab from table range check my table as headers okay and then also rename it as list underscore b and make a connection close and load to only create connection okay and then go back to the power query by double clicking any of the tables so i will double click the master table here and then on the queries pane right click and then new query other sources and then blank query so let's create a blank query here and then i will call this three table by using the table that combine but you can also use the append uh, queries so here we just wanted to list all the table so in curly bracket first table is the master table comma list a and then list b okay we need to close the table that combine enter that's it we have these three columns from three different tables so uh, i will choose all the columns right click and then merge columns okay and then we have this one column already or a list uh, in merge columns. And then uh, here uh, in this formula bar, I will remove the duplicate. So I will use table.distinct. And then close it. Enter. That's it. That's the unique list. Now here we can apply the list of difference. So uh, in the same formula bar so go back to that i will write list that difference and this is our first list this table here the merge table here but uh we will convert it into list by calling the uh, column names which in this case is the merge column so that's it and then comma the second table will be the master table and then make it as a list by calling the column name master and that's it close it so uh, this is the first list again this whole table here we compare it with the master table so whatever is the common remove that retain those that are new enter and that's it that's the new data to be added on the master list so let's rename that list to be added And that's it that's finished we can load it into the spreadsheet by going to the home tab close and load to in a table existing worksheet uh, put it in cell g1 okay that's it now we can quickly check it um, uh, let's say in the list a we have a data that is also in the master uh, list let's say apple when you click data and refresh all, 
that should not be added on the list. It's not a new data because it's already on the master list. But let me try another one in list B. Let's say it's uh, strawberries. And then refresh all. That's it. That's going to be added because it's a new data. And that's it. I'm finished here. I'm done. If you like this video, you can subscribe to my channel. Click the subscribe button and see you next time and thanks.